today, summer officially arrived in Portugal. And this weekend, they are also arriving. Portugal is receiving the Pundakit Virtuosi, a string ensemble from Zambales, Philippines, for three memorable concerts. So, who are the Pundakit Virtuosi? To talk about the origins of Pundakit Virtuosi, we have to talk about Alfonso Bolipata and his project Casa San Miguel. This project advocates the arts and brings the young people to learn and grow with art, in particular with music. Alfonso Bolipata made a museum and set up galleries. He conducted and organized workshops and even an annual festival. He transformed a small region that was back then devastated by the eruption of volcano Mount Pinatubo into a center of excellence for young talents who wanted to pursue their dream of becoming musicians. Pundakit Virtuosi is a product of this environment. Young artists, many of them teenagers, have learned and excelled in playing string music instruments. They are children and young adults from humble origins who are given the opportunity to dream bigger and the conditions to achieve it. Today, their ambition, determination and skill have gone beyond Pundakit. This year, they are embarking on a European tour holding concerts in France, Austria, Belgium, Vatican, Italy, Spain, Germany and Portugal. We're very happy to host the Pundakit Virtuosi for the first time here in Lisbon. Um, it's their first trip to Europe and uh, under the auspices of the Department of Foreign Affairs Cultural Diplomacy Unit, we are now uh, among the many embassies in Europe that have hosted the Pundakit Virtuosi during the month of June. It's a very unique experience and we're very happy to share the opportunity for the Pundaki to come here and showcase the best of Philippine culture, tradition, through music, through the music of the young children, through the talented Filipino children of Pundaki in the Philippines.